where are all you guys gonna be in 10 years? How do I know that in the next four years? Ronnie, where are you gonna be in 10 years? Eating a burger, sitting in your car? Probably. <laughs> I don't care if you're gonna, you know, do fast food and pump gas for the next five years. The diploma leaves the door open. I don't have a dream. I have something that will help me out, will help us out. A few years ago, you were just a little kid, you know? And all of a sudden, now you're gonna have a gun in your hand and people are gonna be shooting at you. It's not like that. It's for me. It's for knowing that I actually went out and did something for my country. I know they're doing it for themselves, but... Do they ever think about the people they're leaving behind? I'll tell you, when you really begin to see and know America is when you get away from it and look at it from a completely different point of view. I'm just trying to tell you guys that there's people out there that are just using your dedication you know, for their own personal gain. We don't have a whole lot of time. Because we leave next month. Yeah. Next month. I'm a quick end. I can do this. Many people can. And I'm doing it for a good cause. I'm trying to tell you guys why you still have the choice. Because once you, uh, once you go to basic training, you're in. Society where we have so many people that are so inwardly focused and they're all concerned about themselves. I'm thankful that we still have young men and women that are willing to sacrifice their lives to defend our country. Just take time and think about all the stuff that we're going to have after I'm out of the Army, excluding me going to war.